What's up guys? I am back again. Um, as you can see in the video, the last video, uh, we got the Honda painted. Um, as you can see, in some spots, it's like real gloss. There's a lot of spots, pretty much 99% of the car is like a satin. Um, that was not on purpose. I uh, was having some air gun issues. I don't know how to set them up. Oh, here we go, a little. Uh, but I'm just happy that it's all uniform. This is something that I can just sand down later with like 600 grit and then respray with a proper setup gun. And I have enough paint to do it. And now the body work is like pretty much perfect. Besides, you can see a couple little dents. There's one right here that like I couldn't see. Yeah, you can kind of see it right there. And there's some other spots like that. So later down the road, maybe this winter, I'm gonna paint it, like, and finish it off with the rest of my paint and get it, like, glossy. But I'm happy with how the results are. But before this meet I'm going to in Holland, I gotta do a couple things in the car. One of those is gonna be taking these out, sanding them, and spraying them, or just buffing and waxing them until I can spray them in the booth with some real clear coat. Uh, yeah, these are just really faded. The other thing is down here. So down here is where it's getting bad. Um, as you can see, I've welded a plate on the bottom and that's like almost freaking scraped through. Uh, the flex pipe is leaking quite a bit as well as this is kind of bent from I think this hitting the ground and just like the constant pressure up. As you can see, like <laughs> that's the lowest part of the car, like subframe scratch. Um, this car does sit pretty low. It's just on 17s. Catalytic converters starting to get scraped. But my goal is to fix this and see if I can s somehow maybe get another exhaust flange in there. This one's bad. The one back here. This is like, must be a different angle. Yeah, you can see that. It's right. Yeah, you can just see that with the little bolt and you can see the hole. So I think what I need to do is cut this off first then I can figure out what I need and then see what I can do about getting these things to fit up better. See what this looks like. So this isn't bad. This could probably just use a gasket, but, and I'm just scared to even get into it right now because I got a weekend trip. Okay, so this is out. What I have to do next is I'm gonna cut this off, cut that off, and then I'm gonna reattach it. But right here you can see that this is totally just not there. So what I need to do is weld something in so it'll be solid. So I'm gonna weld a washer on there so that I can have something to hold on to. I think I'm gonna get a new one that sits a little bit higher up. They do have different ones. I just need to do some research, but and I need to fix this exhaust hanger because it's really just dangling from the hanger back there. But yeah, so I guess for right now I'm gonna get that welded and that cut. Okay, so I got this light, so it's pretty much daytime under here. But what I've gotten is I got some new gaskets for these two. Um, I did not put them in yet just because I'm getting this welded in, but instead of using a flex pipe, which I bought for like 60 bucks, it doesn't fit right, but it was the shortest one. I have this piece of stainless that fits perfectly. So next up, what I'm going to do is I'm going to weld it there and here as well as I can. And then I'm going to take it off the car and finish weld it. I got this pushed up some as well to get that risen up. And I should probably hang up the rear, but that's uh, this is the worst of my worries right now. So Okay, I got this piece welded on somewhat. So I got it off of the car so I can weld the pole weld and uh, yeah I also welded the washer onto this piece I just took all of that uh, I got new gaskets there I got one already but I'm gonna add a second one there this one's all busted out you can see so luckily I'm getting new ones I'll, I already picked up these ones but I gotta wait till tomorrow to get this one. Got this piece all welded up 
and coated. Next is to toss it into the car. All right, the exhaust is on. Let's turn it around and see. It might still leak a little bit, but it should be a lot better. So we are good with that. All right, we are back. Um, ended in the video off here. Uh, I went to Holland for a end of the season car meet. Right now I am just swapping wheels over. A little bit of tarnish is the rim rubbing, but I mean, that's kind of to be expected, so. Chase is over there taking some pictures. And then we got Trevor, Gabe, a new friend, and then Jack. So Chase, HG Shade, he'll be uh, taking some pictures or has taken pictures. But what you got to say about the car, bro? That's some good input. I'll definitely do that to it next. But all right, peace out, guys. I'll just have a quick cap when we get home. But yep, thanks for watching.